What's going on YouTube? All right, so now we're gonna get into the uh, the other boat I bought from TOBSD.com. Uh, it is their carbon fiber outrigger. I think they sell it for around 580, somewhere around in that mark. Uh, it runs on 6S. It, it's, it, it looks badass. It's really powerful and fast, but the hull needs to be reinforced at the seams. Um, it's really thin carbon fiber. It does not hold up to my standards and I'll show you why. If you haven't seen the video of it being destroyed, um, I'll show you right now, I guess a little more in depth of what happened to it and uh, what it has inside. All right, so here's the carbon fiber outrigger. Uh, like I said, this is, <laughs> it's an awesome boat. Um, honestly, it crashed, yes, it did not hold up to what I thought it should, but it should have been ran simply on smooth glass water. Um, it, take in mind, it didn't have any big waves, but it, it had little little ripples that will cause it to bounce around and uh, lose control, and this is what happens to it. Um, it started, it cracked a little right there, but it broke apart at the seams. Um, right here and pretty much this whole sponson right here and i squeezed it back together and it just feels like it lost a lot of its uh it's a uh, support um this one over here is still super strong and i mean it's not phased at all but this one just once it's separated it uh it's just weak enough i'm gonna maybe try to repair it maybe get another hole and just throw everything in it um Steering servos back here. I don't have anything special in there. Um, I think I am running a M445 prop, and I mean this thing. I'm I'm guesstimating speeds of around 60 miles an hour. I'm not 100% positive. Could be faster, maybe a little slower, but it's got to be at least 60. Um, I'm honestly not sure of the KV of the motor. Um, I do know it runs on 6S. And that is the stock ESC as well. I did not do any mods. I was going to swap out the motor in ESC with something of mine. Um, which I haven't yet. And I guess I might when I get the new hold. Simply, this thing just looks gorgeous. It's a it's a well, it's a really well designed hull. Uh, like I said, it just needed, needed to be uh, supported a little better at the seams. And not just two shell pieces put together. Um, they needed to add some stability in there somewhere. But overall, I mean, do I think it's worth 580? No, definitely not. Um, but the hole is worth getting and maybe rewrapping it before you throw anything else on it. Um, rewrap this thing with carbon fiber and thicken it up some. And uh, besides that, though, I mean, it's fun. I'll, I'll do something with it and get it back out on the water. I'll go ahead and uh, comment, subscribe if y'all like the video, and uh, share it. And I'll see y'all next time.